Tony, I'm sorry I had to block you from Twitter, but there's just too much pointy rocket activity going on there, and I had to terminate it. But I noticed, Tony, you have this other pointy rocket painting. Those are mountains, Elon. They're rockets to me, and they're pointy. I must have them. I must seize them. I'm sorry, Elon. I can't give that to you. That one's important to me. It reminds me when I was in Bogota, Colombia. Well, then I'll have to call in my Mossad security team, and we'll have to seize it. How much do you want for it, Tony? Uh, no price. One billion dollars. I'll give you one billion, half in Bitcoin, 25% Monero, and the other 25% cash. Deal? Uh, no deal. No deal. I'm keeping that one. That's mine. I see. Elon, how come you blocked me from Twitter? Well, Tony, it's like this. I used to have a South African accent, but then I became westernized. And I became part of the New World Order, indiscreetly, of course. And against my will, I might add. But, Tony, you have to make alliances. And your tweets were talking about Joe Rogan's round rockets, the one he put in the thumbnail, which reminds me Tony, that he will never be my true friend. Never. Exactly. Exactly. You see the reverse psychology, don't you? Yes, I do. I did the pointy rocket to defend you. Because, you know, I mean, CIA Mike, Joey, Fusion Center, spies, Joe Rogan, lots of spies, Joe Rogan, more spies, many spies. I get it. I get it, Tony. I get it. So now, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take this painting back to the space station. It's mine. All mine. All pointy rockets are mine. Ha 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 ha!